Tutorial 9 question 7 hint. In this question hint, we make use of Polya's model to guide us in solving the problem. The first step is to understand the problem. What information is stated in the table? The return of an investment is the extra amount that Sherry obtains for placing her money in the respective accounts. What does the values $151.15 and the value $426 represent? The next step is to devise a plan. In this topic, we form a system of linear equation and solve for the unknowns. What are the unknowns in this question? Can we form equations for the return based on the amount Sherry places in the various accounts? For part 2, how do you think she should place different portion of money to maximize the return? The next step is to carry out the plan. Are you able to form the system of linear equation? The return of the investment by placing the portion in different account is given. How can we express the return of investment in terms of the portion of money placed in different accounts? If you have obtained the solution, the last step is to check the answer. Check the practicality of your solution. Does your answer result in a reasonable answer for the three portions of money? Does your answer fit the information given in the question?